Today, we're learning how to create these sleek, dynamic, rounded hexagonal slides in PowerPoint, completely from scratch. Let's start with a blank slide. Right-click and select Format Background. Then go to Picture Fill. The third option from the list, click Insert and add your image. These images are provided below in the description. Once we insert it, the interface should look like this. Now, go to the Insert tab and place a rectangle like this. Click on Shape Outline and choose No Outline. Then go to Shape Fill and select a black color. Right-click again, choose Format Background, and set the transparency to around 10%. Now, let's add the rounded hexagon. The SVG file for this rounded hexagon is given in the description. You can simply download and open it. It'll look like this. We'll now change its color. So, deselect the hexagon, then right-click, choose Format Background, and select the hexagon again. Next, go to Graphics Format at the top, and select Convert to Shape. Then, go to Format Shape, and choose Slide Background Fill. You can already see how beautifully it stands out. Let's adjust it, and duplicate it. To duplicate, press Ctrl plus Shift, and drag it using the left mouse button. That'll give you a clean duplicate. Now, repeat this three more times and arrange them like this. With all the shapes selected, go to Shape Format at the top, click Group, and group them. Now adjust the size. It won't distort the aspect ratio. Then go back to Group and select Ungroup. Select all four shapes, press Ctrl plus Shift, and drag them upward slightly using the left mouse button. Arrange them like a honeycomb pattern, though you can choose any layout you like. Delete the outer shape. It's not needed. Now, select any three shapes by holding Ctrl and clicking on them, then press Shift while dragging them upward a bit. Arrange them in a similar way. Repeat this step to complete the honeycomb structure. We're done with the shapes. Now, let's group them line by line. For the first line, select all three and press Ctrl plus G. Do the same for the second line. Select all shapes in the same row and either use the shortcut or the group option. Repeat this for the third, fourth, and fifth lines as well. Let's add the title. Go to Insert and add a text box. Type your title. We're using the font Monsterate, size 46, bold, and a nice white color. Add another text box for the content. Same font, regular weight, white color, and font size 14. Now, let's animate the hexagons. Select the first line, go to the Animations tab, and choose the Fly-In animation. Click on the Animation pane. It opens on the right side. You'll see one animation applied to the first line. Right-click that animation and select With Previous. Then go to Effect Options. Open the Timing tab and set the duration to 2 seconds. Now switch to the Effects tab. Choose the direction. From top, set a smooth start of 0.32 seconds and a bounce end of 1.02 seconds, then click OK. Click on the rectangle we added earlier and send it to the back. This keeps the animation flow smooth. Next, go to the second grouped shape, line number 2. Give it the same fly-in animation, set it with previous, direction from top, duration 2 seconds, smooth start 0.32 seconds, and bounce end 1.01 seconds, then click OK. Repeat the same for the third line. Apply fly-in, direction from top, duration 2 seconds, and the same smooth and bounce settings. For the fourth line, choose from bottom instead. Other settings remain the same. Finally, do the same for the fifth line. You can also use the Animation Painter to copy and paste animations quickly. Now select all the shapes and move them slightly to the right like this. Let's add a glowing effect to the text. Select the title, go to Text Options, then Text Effects, and choose Shadow with Center Offset and White Color.
Adjust the blur to around 30. This creates a smooth glowing effect. Do the same for the content text. You can try other colors too. For example, I'm using orange text with an orange shadow using the same settings. Now, for animating the text, select both text boxes by holding Ctrl and clicking on them. Go to the Animations tab, open the Animation pane, and apply Fly In. Set it to With Previous, Duration 2 seconds, Direction from Left, Smooth Start 0.4, 2 seconds, and Bounce End 1 second. Adjust the text boxes slightly lower if needed. Finally, to make it work with any image, duplicate the slide by right-clicking on the slide thumbnail. Go to the new slide, right-click, select Format Background, and choose Picture Fill again. Insert a new image, and boom, you're done. You can always tweak the text effects to match your theme. Let's preview it. Now you know how to make these clean animated hexagonal slides in PowerPoint. Thanks for watching.